Hi, this is Martin Aringer speaking from the Lucas Congress at Düsseldorf. We've just almost finished the new classification criteria project. And there's in ESM three things that are going to change slightly. One is the anti-nuclear antibodies, which is the screening test in clinical routine, are going to be the entry criteria. That is classification criteria that is not strictly meant for diagnosis and should not strictly be used for diagnosis, but rather for studies. Therefore, it's not such a problem that there may be occasionally patients who really do not have the ANA positive. But in the trials, it's going to help us to get a more clear patient population fitting better together with probably better outcomes. The second issue is, so far, all items have counted the same. So things that have not very specific, as we say in medicine, so which need not be lupus, it could be something else like virus infection, have the same weight as other things that are very clearly lupus and are very severe disease, such as histology of renal involvement, which is a very specific finding. The third issue is you have to resolve the problem that many of the lupus features can also happen because of other reasons, such as infections or other autoimmune diseases. And what the new criteria now will do is demand from the physician to check whether it's really due to lupus. If there is another explanation that is more likely, it's not to be counted. The final point is. It is pretty clear that some of the features within one domain, such as antibodies to DNA and to SM, are correlated to each other. So we created domains, buckets, and you are only allowed to score the highest one in those domains. And together, it looks like we match the highest sensitivity, so we will lose very few patients in the classification, but on the other hand, be quite specific as were the old ACR criteria, which means in the end that you are not giving the label of lupus to somebody who really has something else. That's the main issues. We are not yet completely done, but we are supposed to show the final result at the Euler Congress, and that is actually in a few months from now. Bye.